Beer is the oldest and most widely consumed alcoholic drink in the world. And in the UK alone, we get through really very modest 28 million pints a day. But which country will our diners decide makes the best beer? Two beer experts go head to head, pitching the one beer that they feel best represents their country. The diners vote for their favourite beer and pitch, and the country with the highest combined scores wins a place in the semi finals. It's so exciting! Today's game is America versus Belgium. Let's meet our players. Representing the good old US of A is Christina Picard, and representing Belgium is Mark Struvant. <laughs> As market kitchen landlady, it falls to me to, to I'm, I'm judging this whole thing. I want a good, clean fight, okay? And I think the best way to sort of start who goes first is to have a little darts competition because this is played in every pub. Okay, in the I need a few drinks first, usually. Put your pom poms down, Christina. All right. I think being the girl, and considering you are dressed like that, you should yes, uh, go so, first. So yes. if you'd like to step up to the hockey and give it your best. All right, let's see, doing this sober, okay. Oh, rubbish! Oh, you nearly had the rubbish. camera passes for there. Mark, it's your turn. <laughs> Brilliant. You've got 19, Mark. Come on back here. That means you are going first. I want a good, clean fight, both of you. Are you ready? <laughs> right. US of A, Belgium. Yes. I want a good, clean fight. Right, you're as a very pitch away. Right, I have chosen Blue Moon because I think it perfectly represents America. Their slogan is a bunch of guys having fun, making great beer. What's not to love about that? And I think it's perfect for American culture. It's just, it's fun, it's casual, but also we've taken these traditions, these old world traditions, and we've improved upon You've got a bit of orange stuff. So that's we not do, very yes. traditional. Well, it, you'll be surprised. The Belgians do this as well with some of their beers. Uh, Blue Moon is very citrusy, lots of orange and coriander in it. So it's nice to just enhance the flavors. Time up, time up. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Very good, wasn't it? Very, very good. Very good. I'm going to go down. <laughs> right. I was quite impressed with both of those pitches. Now what I want is a good old-fashioned debate. You've got 60 seconds to fight it out amongst yourselves, and this is it. This is the last time you get to pitch. Are you right. ready? I'm ready. Steady. <laughs> Game on. Go. 12.40. Right. The USA didn't even exist. Exactly. We were you had nearly a thousand years. You can't bring that into it. Christina. It, you guys well, had, because we have an origin heritage. <laughs> you've had nearly a thousand years to perfect, this is a copy to of perfect Belgium a there. couple of styles. We talk about flavor. Over, over just a the very small period of time. Chocolate, it you, guys aren't even, right, you guys aren't even a we country, have okay? Cheese. The only people that even know anything about you are the Dutch and the French, and they make fun of you, okay? <laughs> can't hear, can't hear. One at a time. You go again. What, were you, what was it you just said? Right. Like? My very excellent point that I was making was that you, you have been making beer for nearly a thousand years. We have been making beer for much less. You've perfected a few styles. We've and taken, learned from us. We, and we totally admit that. We are okay, on the back. Enough. That's enough. Come on. <laughs> oh. Does your beer go with Belgian chocolate? Does your beer go with yes, the Belgian our cheese? Beer goes with Does everything. your beer go with Belgian cheese? America. Bigger, better, variety. Do you have your new glasses? Life, we have for yeah. every beer in Belgium, we have a unique glass. The same. You guys drink oh, out so of jobs. What about the glass? So what about the frozen the mug? Don't give me that. Anyone been to the States? You're in a bar. You've had three or four. You don't care. You are talk about quality. Now, earlier in the second leg of the Market Kitchen World Beer Tournament, Christina Pickard battled for the USA and Mark Struband played for Belgium. Mr. Merritt, did you have a particular favourite? Yeah, I thought it, a strong pitch from Belgium, but your beer tastes like a Christmas pudding's fallen in it. I'm going <laughs> USA. Oh, that's harsh. Yeah. harsh. <laughs> Mr. Fort? I must say, it was a very, very hard fought battle out there. Battle of the words. When it comes to the battle of the beers, I'm afraid it's the cloudy beer put me on cloud nine. Oh. So. All right. Oh. What do ah. they know? Indeed. They know nothing. It's not up to them, it's up to our diners. Now, they voted for their favourite beer in a blind tasting and their favourite pitch as well. And I can reveal... Do, 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 do. So that the combined score means the winner is... America! <laughs> I'm so glad to beat Belgium, although I knew I would, and I'm excited to come back for the semi-finals.